welcome back guys and today we will be looking at a city now i thought to myself how could i make my videos more interesting and x-rays have always fascinated undergraduates or graduates alike so i thought let's do a video about city and today i got a pretty good city it's a 16 slice ct scan of the head okay so this is the position in which the head is placed and then 16 slices are taken now when we observe so this is the first slice in the first slice some things are apparent okay so in the first slice here you have the frontal sinus which is prominent so it means okay he is not a neonate so more than one years of age and then here we can see the nasal cavities the front incisors so this is from the front so this is the front part so the slices are take, being taken from the front now the principles are same as x-ray okay if anything is dark that is air so things like this will be air soft tissue and hard tissue so it's pretty much similar to how you would be reading an x-ray in the second slide slice here we start to see some amount of extra growth so it can be a turbinate but again here you have the nasal septum deviating okay so if you see that the nasal septum is deviating towards the right and again more teeth are showing so you come a little back now again something can be made out in the frontal sinus over here okay so there is something frontal sinus is supposed to contain entirely air but you can see some amount of mass so when we go a little further here you can see a mass again a mass now the mass from this we can interpret is huge it's a huge mass and it's non homogeneous okay because it has some amount of white white this white white patches in it which means either it's becoming more harder because of deposition of more calcified or mineralized what but some heart tissue is being deposited at that site okay now again here we can see that yes it is pretty encapsulated and it still having that non homogeneity and one more thing you can notice is look at the eye position in this orbit the eye position is here and here it's pushed to the margin okay remove my drawings so you can notice it properly the eyes in the orbits have been pushed to the margins okay see how clearly the mass has again it has infiltrated deeply into the nose and the septum here has been deviated extremely okay so there's almost a collapse of the nasal passage on the right side and even the orbital contents because of this mass have been pushed in the left okay there's deviated nasal septum to the right and the orbital contents have been pushed away in the left well we continue looking further uh, here yeah here here you can see a clear rim around the mass okay there's a rim like this a clear rim around the mass is clearly visible at this point it states what it states that it's well encapsulated okay it's a mass it's non homogeneous and it's well encapsulated so you can see that more clearly and one more thing which you will be able to notice is it is you see this bone it is attached to that bone okay uh, it's not very clear if it's bone arising for that you would have to do a biopsy but from this we can clearly make out that it is well attached to that bone or it is a 
part or extension of that bone so it has something to do with the bone either it's firmly attached okay so either it's firmly attached or it's an extension of the bone okay again i think it will be more clear in the upper yeah here it's even more clear here see it's well encapsulated and the capsule is in contact with the bone okay you can see that for yourself the capsule is in contact with the bone which means either it's an extension or it's fixed to it and again uh, these are all normal uh, slices and yeah, these are all normal slices so in whole this was the ct that we saw from this what can we make out we can make out that one it's a non homogeneous mass second it is well encapsulated if it's well encapsulated and it's a mass there's a high chance that it's benign so it's a benign tumor it's a non homogeneous mass it's showing a bit amount of calcification we'll assume it's calcification and then it has something to do with bone what could it be something which is benign something which has to do with a bone and something that's growing in the face the facial area the diagnosis for this is it's an osteoma okay benign tumor of the bone it's an osteoma osteoma diagnosis is osteoma now other things which will you will have to mention in the report if you are a radiologist is the deviated nasal septum you would have to mention the dns so we also have dns to the right and compression of orbital contents in the left plus you have a major mass that is the osteoma so all the other things that are described about the osteoma should also be encapsulated so hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll see you in my next one thanks for watching subscribe for more take care bye